Hello and welcome to my, as of this video, unnamed toy segment. <laughs> so for the first one, I thought I would do something that I really love, which is these Bob's Burgers Pop figures. Um, I don't have a lot of pops, I just have a couple, but when I saw these, I was like, you all have to come home with me. They're cute and tiny, and they look just like the ones off the TV show. Exactly. <laughs> like, as with most pops, they're super detailed for being so small. Like, just the amount of love and detail they put into these just make it, like... They make them so much more realistic. Like, I feel like I'm actually watching the cartoon, kind of. Exactly. Like, I just hear in my head, like... That's not the like song, all the themes but... I actually know. <laughs> that was like Green Acre song. Okay, probably no one watching this remembers that. <laughs> I right. don't even remember that. No, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so my absolute favorite one is Bob because I just feel like with him he has the most detail, like down to the hair on his arms. Oh my god, I know. Like that's one thing. Like I have to really give to them is like actually like you can tell they actually focused really hard on the cartoon. They picked up all the details of like mm -hmm. the actual art on it too. Cause like some pops I see like occasionally can be a little flat to me. Yeah, like they're just like the colors or they're, you know what it is and it obviously looks like it, but some of them have like pristine down to the last microscopic detail. He's even got a little burger. Um, the best part of this pop is oh, let's his see bald it. spot. <laughs> That is awesome. Um, it's just adorable. And even a little tie on his apron. Like, ridiculous. Linda, always cute as well. Uh, she has a little pen in her pocket, which, if you watch the show, she always has a pen in her pocket. Not that it's, like, a huge... Like, like detail or anything like that, but, but it, it's that added element that, instead of just giving her a flat apron, Funko was like, no, we have to add that pen. pen in her <laughs> Tina, also cute. Uh, her notebook says... Friend fiction, I believe. I can't, I, really. I don't Friend remember now. Hold on, let's see if I can pick it up. But I like. I just like that they actually have the detailing. So they actually picked up the stuff that she normally does in the episodes, and like they put that into yeah, the pop like instead of just having her in her dress recognize. alone. But look, even the little high socks, and I like how in the eyes, unlike Linda's glasses, let's grab Linda's glasses here have like the clear lenses they actually notice like in the episodes her eyes are actually filled in white within the glasses itself so instead of just giving her regular glasses they fold it in i like that that's ridiculous cute. ridiculously cute let's see what's it's good darby crazy erotic friend fiction but loose <laughs> which may be inappropriate for younger viewers so forget i said that <laughs> Jean, uh my favorite detail is that he's actually pressing the key on the keyboard like it's not just like his hands over it like the keys actually pressed down Aww. ridiculous ridiculously cute Louise, she's holding her little stuffed animal thing. I can't remember what it's called. I feel hand. like she's me when I was on. No. <laughs> she's, she is our spirit. <laughs> uh, uh, I actually have the ears that they saw at Hot Topic. The little hat ears I have, but they don't stay up. I need to try to rig the ears to stay up. But she's just so cute. And I like her little slipper over here. The little pigtails at the back that stick out. And I like how all these stands like... Yay Funko for realizing this. A lot of these are top heavy, so now a lot of these, as you can see, have the clear um, stands to them because some that aren't top heavy don't need it. But I like how they actually did that. You know, that little bit of extra is good. And also, like, here's a different pop. Their heads are ridiculously not as square or big. Hmm. I wonder if they're like Funko's trying to like maybe design them to look more character accurate instead of making them all look like pops that have costumes on they actually look like the characters which I like but then I also don't like because it I mean not it looks like you're taking away from the pop like then you're just making a little figure but these look really good like they still have the square heads they're just smaller yeah I agree well obviously the kids have to be smaller because they're kids versus adults so that mm -hmm. I get but even the even let's move these guys even Bob has a smaller head than this lady. Well, like, she does have a big headdress. No, look. Oh, head. it's on the back. Uh, I can see that. She's a little more square. Maybe they're getting away from and the square. And it's wider as well. Hmm, hmm, hmm. However, I mean, all companies change things, and that's what keeps people interesting, so I'm totally okay with it. Huh, so comment below. Have you guys seen differences in Funko Pop heads in the past, like, year or so? Because they are about a year difference with these compared to the other ones. But that's one thing that's kind of interesting. I did not know that. But, hey, if you guys want to comment below, are you guys big Bob's Burger fans? We definitely are. I'm even wearing my Bob's Burger shirt, even though you guys can't really see right now. But I'm, <laughs> I'm wearing it. 
<laughs> um, I don't have Bob's Burgers shirt, so I couldn't wear mine. And me and Elvira are not the same size, so unfortunately, I couldn't borrow hers either. I know. I thought I would let her borrow my shirt, though. <laughs> she would. She's a good friend like that. So comment below if what you think of these pop figures in general or Bob's Burgers, who's seen every episode. I'm on season four, and I've seen the new episodes. I'm just lacking a couple in the middle that I'm catching up on Netflix. I've seen new episodes and miss chunks of episodes. I, know. I don't understand. I'm You're right. I won't judge you too much. <laughs> too much. Um, again, don't forget to on our introduction to my segments thing channel video to comment what you want to be called and all the other stuff we asked in that video. Cut this part out. Because we all love Robin. And definitely check out our social media as always. Thanks for watching, you guys. Hope you liked our Bob's Burger episode with Robin.